Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Really is quite the evolution in a fairly short period of time, according to the New York Times. I know you've noted on multiple occasions just how long this investigation had dragged on. Have you ever seen a federal case play out like this before? No, Erica, it's really inexplicable to me. Hold up. I mean, first we had basically five years of behind the scenes investigation with no transparency, no action, and some questions being asked, what's taken so long? But in the last couple months, we've seen a pattern here, and Marshall just laid it out. We've now seen it play out two or three separate times. DOJ moves towards a very lenient disposition. They're just about to lock in that lenient disposition, and then there arises pressure, either through whistleblower testimony or through public scrutiny, and then DOJ backs off and says, actually, we're not gonna do that now that it's been called out. We're gonna try to up it a little bit. Wait a minute. And then that happened again. And then they go all the way to appointing special counsel, the same guy who's been presiding over the case for five plus years already. So I genuinely am perplexed by what DOJ is doing here. Something ain't right. I think they've made a real mess for themselves and now they're gonna have to deal with the consequences of it. I know I keep saying this, but someone is not sending the DNC checks to CNN. So they are not carrying water for the Democrats like usual.